and welcome yourselves to the channel. We are finally here, the penultimate episode of Big Shot Season 1. A phenomenal show. Go check it out for yourself. Subscribe and like. Let me know down below in the comments if you checked it out. And if so, if you enjoy it, let me know. Spoilers ahead. Enjoy. So, you know, it's this, this the theme. There's so much crammed into these 45, 46, 47, 48 minute episodes. I should have just said... <clears throat> Um, these long episodes, um, but they're expanding on what we know. They're expanding on, you know, everything we've worked towards from episode one to this point. Him being a coach, him realizing one day he will leave to go back to college ball, and you know, keeping this secret about going to uh, the university in California, making up dark disappointments, being distant from everybody, and ultimately just trying to get through everything. The theater. Uh, performance get through the last game get through all these things before anyone finds out and he can leave quietly because he still deep down cares about the team he still wants to get everything done get this team to d2 and get holly as coach he again is going above and beyond everything he's put everything in place he has set everything into fashion into motion and to make sure these kids have the best future for them you know when the kids at the theater thing found out and he was like they're all going to leave regardless. I don't know why they care so much about him staying in the long haul, you know. But it makes sense in some ways because if you reflect on um, what um, Emma said at the end, and you think <laughs> she made it very personal, you know, putting everything lower than, you know, he wants to be the, he wants to be the big guy. And he's putting friendship and relationships and the, the, the girls below all that. Not intentionally, because college is all he knows. And it's sort of, she's sort of saying, you haven't learned anything this season. You haven't learned anything about compassion or being humanized or these people. And I, I loved how well the theatre performance came about because it was well put together. Her and Harp put a great performance on it. And for it to end like that, you know, pointing the sword at corn and saying these things and having such an impactful quote to end the episode leading into the finale of what is Marvin going to do you know because this entire episode you know Holly's out of hospital she has been rejected by the board Marvin's going to do everything he can to get her at that head coach job but ultimately as well he's questioning everything is the right choice what does Emma's best intentions have at heart uh, and aside from all that you know step away from Marvin you have what destiny goes through her her scenes with her mother i think it's Keila settle i think that's her name yeah, from great showman a wondrous emotional phenomenal scene between them two delving deep into her not being a biological mother but being the mother that's been there from day dot and cared every step of the way and there's just so many emotional scenes in these episodes i genuinely can't get enough of it um you have Olive you with her new boyfriend type person who keeps um, being left side, right sided. In a sense, of he's being a bit flaky at times because of he doesn't want to be called out from his cars back people and friends that are obviously going to be like who are messing with him. And he's like, is he is his his intentions good or bad? I'm guessing we'll find out in the final episode because going off. The bio for the last episode, it says the playbook has gone missing, so we'll have to see what happens with that. Giggles hurt a leg, and apparently she's being bullied by the Carl's back people. Ho um, Holly is um, offered the job at Carl's back to replace the coach by uh, McCarthy, who has, you know, put a lot of damage over in the years, but she's got the best out of her. She can see the potential. She can see what she's capable of. And with Corn leaving and now a possibility of Holly leaving, this finale is going to be very tense and the girls will be even further away from everything, you know. They need the coaches in the, in the game and these two, the two, the only two coaches who are there have been appointed or approached by two different people. So the girls are going to feel even more lost. But ultimately, I do think... I don't actually know what happens by the end. You know, they get Carl's back. I believe they'll beat McCarthy because they'll come together in this unity. Giggles will get over her, ex her anxieties against uh, Carl's back, and ultimately she will recover her leg. I think um, depends how long of a time skip, not time skip per se, but how long it's been since the theater play. Um, 
but yeah, so many good scenes, so many good moments. Um, Emma's very, I want to say Emma's very forceful and demanding. She can't just let people be. She's very forceful. That's what it, I, I, I've not really said many issues with the show, but she's very in your face and it can be, it can be annoying. She's very, if she doesn't get her way, she has to make it, you know, happen. And she's very, she's a bully at times. She's very forceful. She demands too much stuff. And she's a bit annoying at times. But yeah, other than that, you had a bit of drama between the teachers and some of the kids. Um, will their loyalty last? Um, or, re- or or will it be regained in this finale? I'm pretty sure it will. I'm pretty sure it'll end up on a happy ever after. They'll get to D2. Um, and... Um, Emma won't leave, Corn won't leave, Holly won't leave, and they'll solidify Holly as the main coach. I'm pretty sure that's what will happen, but, you know, all guesses could be wrong. But let's dive into the finale shortly. Hope you enjoyed the videos. Thanks for watching, as always. Hit that subscribe button and await Season 2, which will drop shortly after my Episode 10 review. So thanks for watching, as always. Leave your comments down below if you're enjoying it or if you're not enjoying it. And of course, any other requests you have, leave it in the comments and I'll get around to it at some point. Thanks for watching as always and goodbye.